welcome you ringside. Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and we're just about ready for action. EA Sports presents 12 Rounds of Boxing. Diddley Klitschko's got his eye on the prize. Look at that focus and determination during his ring walk. David Hayes ring walk. He just exudes confidence, carrying himself like a champion. Introducing first, with a record of 41 wins, 38 by way of knockout, and only two losses, the talent, Dr. Iron Fist, Klitschko. And his opponent across the ring, an impressive record of 25 victories, including 23 knockouts. And only one defeat coming out of London, David the Haymaker Hay. Remember, guys, obey my commands at all times. Let's have a good, clean fight. Touch them up. They're scheduled to spend a half an hour swapping weather. This a 10 round. Precision work with the left hand by Vitaly Klitschko. Teddy at six foot seven and a half. When Vitaly Klitschko gets his full leverage, these headshots can be so damaging. Yeah, they can because he's shifting that whole six foot seven inches into the punch. Vitaly Klitschko's defense is now serving him well. Nice job blocking that punch. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by Vitaly Klitschko. How about that left hand? Vitaly Klitschko is turning into a star in this sport. Why? Because he has power. The one thing that people want to see. What should we expect to see of that power early on? Well, whether or not he's fighting a tricky guy tonight. Can he come up with a device, a way to take that power and get it to the target? Halfway through round number one. Really on the mark with that over-the-top shot with the right hand. Good combination by Vitaly Klitschko. He's got his opponent in trouble if he can start to put those together. When we talked with Vitaly Klitschko all week long, he told us the key to this fight is his jack. He just delivered a good one there. David Hay doesn't get a ton of credit as a defensive fighter, but that was some good defense with that block. Vitaly Klitschko starting to score at ease against his opponent there. Anytime you can land a three-punch combination, you're really hitting your groove. Good job protecting himself. Vitaly Klitschko's doing well here with that two-punch combination. Super jab by Vitaly Klitschko. Nice block that time. It was intended to the head. When Vitaly Klitschko has that jab working, then the straight punch comes with ease. And this round comes to an end. Look at that swollen eye. David Hayes' eye is basically shut. And right now, he's got to concentrate harder than he has before, maybe than he ever has before. And he's got to make sure that he sees everything coming at him somehow, finds a way, even looking through that little slit. Let's go. Here we go. Round two is underway. On the mark with the combination by Vitaly Klitschko. One, two, one, two. Good job staying away from the danger there. Uppercut. To the head he goes with a left hand. Lands a big hook. 
That's a good left hand by David Hay. He got hit right there, but he also gave one. Solid effort by David Hay. You know, we only show up when it's time to watch them do their thing for the fight, but they're really working at it day in and day out just to make weight. What's so tough about making weight in boxing? Well, it can weigh you down. I mean, it takes discipline. And all of a sudden, it allows you a trail of excuses because now you can start to say, well, gee, you know, I didn't do this. You know, I, I, it's the drudgery of it, and it's the consistency of it. When you have to stay at a weight and you have to watch that weight, you have to balance it where you're also going to be able to have a physicality when you get in the ring. You don't want to be weak, so you want to get that right balance where you're disciplined, you get the weight down, but you don't lose that physical edge. David Hayes got a cut. It looks like it's below the eye on the cheek, but it's something that needs to be monitored. Great movement to get away from those punches. It's almost as if he's jousting with that left hand. Vitaly Klitschko brings so much behind it. For the well-being of the fighter, his corner may need to stop this fight. Yeah, the well-being of now and tomorrow, because this is the kind of beating that's going to impact him tomorrow, take his confidence away. Maybe never be the same fighter if they don't stop it at the right time. And we come to the end of round number two. You know, Teddy, I'm looking at that cut as he's in the corner now, and it doesn't look good at all. Do you think he thinks he has to go out there and try to end this fight? Not only does he think it, I think he's right. I think that he probably has very little time left before the referee or the doctor is going to stop him. And he needs to be thinking that way if he's not. Back up top he goes. Turn the sender with the left hand. Vitaly Klitschko's fully committed to utilizing the jab, and I think it's working out well for him early on. Well, it is. It's kind of like, you know, sending static out there. You, you want to scramble somebody's radio signal. You know, that's what the jab does. It scrambles the radio signal, or at least in boxing terms, it throws the other guy's rhythm off. Good jab by Vitaly Klitschko. Returning fire. Well done by Vitaly Klitschko. He's showing what a skilled fighter he is with the counter punching. Well, the old timers used to say when you calm in there, when you control in there, you can make him do what you want. He made him tie his shoelaces right there. Scores well to the head with the right hand. Nomination to the head. You can hear the corner of David Hay telling him to clinch right now. They know that he was rocked. Oh, a big shot comes home for him. How will David Hay react now? A power shot just floored him. One, two, three, four. David Hay finding the energy to rise up after being rocked. All right, something's seriously wrong here, Teddy. It's early on in the fight. David Hayes' conditioning is already showing us that he's nowhere near being able to be in this fight. Well, that showed me that he gave up before this fight ever started. And somebody's got to tell him in his corner, you know what, it's harder to quit than it is to fight because you got to live with the results of that quitting. Stay away from that power. The beginning of round four, a chance to look at the scorecards. And Teddy, you like what he's done so far early, a clean sweep of all three rounds. Yeah, a couple of rounds were close, but on the inside, when both of them had their chance to separate a little bit, he was the one who made the right decision to punch. Good combination to the head. Vitaly Klitschko's giving us a taste of some of that athletic ability, that hand speed right there. Good combination. And his opponent, though, now is going to have to show us that he could do something to sort of, you know, adjust to this, to counter this. And that's going to be controlling range and timing. 
because he can't match up with the physical hand speed. Nice one, two by Vitaly Klitschko. Takes one, but gives one. Good work by Vitaly Klitschko. Oh, and he got caught right there. Everything was going fine, and then he got caught. Well, that's the problem. It was going too fine. He got a full sense of security. The other guy wasn't thrown back. He took for granted, and bang, you can't take for granted in this ring. Two snapping jabs by David Hay. Vitaly Klitschko's right hand working well that time. He scored well. And you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head. Oh, uh, you see him with the left of the head there? Not able to connect with the uppercut. Come on, Boxing 101. Oh! David Hayes, always so confident. Now he has to believe in himself. He needs to get up after being knocked down again. David Hayes showing you what he is made of, getting up off the canvas after being knocked down. Sharp and accurate one-two by Vitaly Klitschko. Comes right back at him with a left hand. Solid right by David Hayes. End of this round. Alongside Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore. Now they got some work to do here. The man was just dropped. Yeah, the first thing is you put some cold water. You can't use that. You clear his head, and you tell him why he was dropped. David Hayes out there for another round after being knocked down in the last round. We know what happens in the 60 seconds with a fighter who was... Wow! That was a big shot that floored him, and it's a big shot that may end him right here. That looked like the great pitch of great Maddox. His sinker ball. Boy, it went down quick. Down he goes, but he's going to continue on, beating the count. Really a lot of consistency from him with the right hand. Took a shot, now he gives the left. Italy Klitschko's doing really well on the outside. A well-targeted jab that time. Scored well upstairs with the right hand. Took a shot, now he gives the left. David Hayes' punch is far off the target. Vitaly Klitschko's here in these middle rounds, and he's doing a very fine job of just boxing and controlling the fight. Well, what he's done a real good job of, Joe, is he understands what he is, who he is, and he's staying to those strengths and staying away from the weaknesses. You know, it doesn't seem like a big deal, like a cut -up. David Hayes crushed. Oh, and there you go. He goes down in the later stages of this round. He's going to try to survive it. This fight is over. Fiddly Klitschko's gunned down yet another opponent. A knockout victory. Ladies and gentlemen, by way of knockouts, your winner, the top, Dr. Iron Fist Klitschko. Now that's how you end a fight right there. Yes. He was controlling throughout, but he made a good, clean finish with the knockout. Yeah, as a trainer, you want to know, can a guy punch? Can a guy defend? You know, can a guy control distance? But you want to know, can a guy finish? He got the answer. Yes, he can finish. For Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore saying thanks for being with us.